Hey guys, it's Nate Jackson, and I wanted to just show you a new feature that I added, a little update that I made to Linked Engine as a version 1.07. So on the uh, Get Contact Emails module, I've added the ability to get not only your contact, your first level contacts emails, but you can also now get their phone numbers. So if you have any sort of a phone number based campaign or text message based uh, campaign uh, now you can get the phone numbers of your contacts so and remember that in order to be able to use this functionality uh, to get you can you can get the emails and the phone numbers of your contacts of your connections so if someone's not connected to you you would first need to add them as a connection uh, using well first you can find them using the LinkedIn search or get people you may know function or the get group members function and then once you have those uh, potential contacts then you would use the interact connect module to add them to your contacts so once they're a part of your contacts then you can get their you just go to get contact emails and it'll get both their emails and their phone numbers so I have a file here loaded called my contacts dot my contacts dash dot CSV I'll show you this folder, show you this file real quickly. Uh, open it here, and it's going to open in Open Office Calc. I recommend that you get this software. It's a nice free alternative to Microsoft Office. So this file was created using the Get uh, Contacts module, and you see it has a LinkedIn profile URL, the name, the title, the industry, and the location. So we're going to start running the Get Contact Emails module and you'll see it uh, collecting the email address as well as the phone number for each person and it's going to create a column here and here for their email address and phone number so i'm going to close this and we're going to open this file well, it's already open so it's we're going to go ahead and run the program click start and it's going to go through my contacts and if their phone number and email address are available as you see here it shows your email address and their phone number so it's going to get that for each of your contacts and go from profile to profile get their contact information for you their email address and their phone number and then it's going to add it to that file of called get contacts uh, called uh, my contacts so I'm gonna let this run and uh, show you the result when we get back so I'll see you in a second okay so we are done and it says here done emails added to uh, my contacts dash dot CSV so we're going to go ahead and it's on my desktop so let's go ahead and take a look at what that file has to offer so we're going to open the file okay so we go over to the end and now you see we have a column called email addresses and a column called phone number so we have all the emails that are available and the phone numbers where they're available so we have the information here uh, when it's uh, listed not everyone puts their email address to contact or their phone number so when it's available uh, the software get it if not it says none listed so that's it uh, I just wanted to show you this update and if you don't have linked engine yet you can get it from createautomate.com or jacksondev.net this is nate jackson signing out and i'll talk to you soon